Think and Grow Rich is such a powerful book. I've been reading this and I've been actually applying some of their techniques that they talk about. And I want to share, I think it was in the first few chapters about setting an intention of how much you want to make and what you are willing to give in order to achieve this kind of income, right? And instead of giving you an example of something in my life, which I'll share maybe at some point, but I want to share a practic practical use of how to use this, right? There's like five steps, right? One of them is set an intention of how much you intend to make and when do you intend to make that money and what are you gonna give in order to get that kind of money. And the giving part is such an important factor Right? It's such an important factor and it's overlooked because we always say we want this, we want that, I want to get this, I want to get that. But we don't, we expect to get it for free without putting any work. And I witnessed this myself because I stayed way longer than I needed to at work because I was dialed in because I set intention of what I plan to give in order to get that kind of money. And so an example, say you want to make 10,000 commission a month. Well, what do you tend to give in order to get them? And for me, I intend to give my clients the best, smoothest way to communicate with me and help them out in their own business, right? By providing them solutions, by providing, um, by being the best version of myself and being as sharp as possible, by finding the best way to communicate with them and making sure everything is spot on, right? So in order to do that, maybe I have to sleep earlier, maybe I have to get in work earlier, maybe I have to think of different ways to communicate with them, find out their needs, Right? These things is what I tend to give in order to get that kind of income. And I've already achieved some things where I was, didn't think it was possible, because, but I, which I didn't think was possible, but because I'm reading those intentions and my plans every morning and every night, I read it in the morning and then I read it at night because our, it goes into our subconscious brain. Right, That's the last thing that we read, the last thing that we think. And because it goes into our mind, we, we, our subconscious believes that, hey, I wanna get this kind of income or this result, and this is what I need to do in order to achieve that. And it's crazy powerful, guys. It's insanely powerful. And I want to share this because maybe you guys have read the book, but maybe you don't apply it in your life. So I would highly recommend that. And reading that book again, I'm gonna continue to read it so I can find other ways, other practical ways in applying some of the techniques that are given in that book. And I want to share it with my audience so you guys can see the power of your mind which I always come back to, I realize the mind is so powerful, right? Yes, yeah, there's different things that you can do, but I believe our mind is our number one tool that gets us closer to the goals that we want to achieve because our mind is what's gonna make our beliefs become reality. And if we can believe in our mind, then why can't it become reality? And so I highly recommend that, guys. Highly recommend that. Of course, if you guys have any questions, you can always reach me out in my Instagram, which will be linked in a bio, or join my Telegram. You know what, I should start creating a Telegram chat for anyone who is interested because I do use Telegram. So I should probably do that. But if you guys wanna join my broadcast channel as well, and if you have any questions, always feel free to reach out and we go from there. Peace.